Okay, here is the big story of the morning. East Baton Rouge school bus drivers threatening to strike or have a sick out if today if they do not get a raise. Yeah, this comes after frustrations boiled over a bit uh, this Thursday's school board meeting. It went late into the night. Our Kelly Hubbard joining us live to kind of break down what happened. Kelly, uh, all right, so a lot of folks want to know what's going on. What's going on? We are live at the transportation office this morning. If you take a look behind me, you can see all of the buses lined up here and we'll get to see throughout the morning if these buses end up leaving to pick up the kids for school today. Many parents and school bus drivers showed up last night hoping to get long awaited answers from the EBR school board members. Here's video from inside that hours long meeting last night. The board spent about half of their time discussing how to address the bus driver shortage. The other half trying to figure out how how to address the bus shortage. One of the pitch solutions is basically throwing money at the problem, including two different stipends for bus drivers. Take a listen to what parents had to say about this. The thing that hurts the most is you would like to get upset with the parent or you want to tell them, well, that's your child. It's your child, your responsibility to make sure that they get to school, get the education. But they don't know that the bus is not coming. Dude, I go to work and be at work on time at 7 o'clock in the morning and leave my child to catch the bus or do I send them out there and then they sitting out there for two, three, four hours and the bus don't show up because we don't have buses. Some of the passionate drivers who showed up say they love driving and they've been on the job for 10 years or more, but many saying that if they cannot get a permanent raise instead of a stipend, they may skip work today. The school board did approve a stipend to address the bus shortage, but is this going to be enough though? Well, amid a lot of the frustration, there is a lot of optimism on the side of the totem pole. Superintendent Dr. Cito Narcisse says that he uh, believes that the stipend will be um, this it plans to help with the staffing shortages. You can see one of the buses leaving there, but is this going to be enough? Our Deanne Guillory is in the first alert center explaining that. Yeah, Callie, breaking down the new big plan can get a little confusing, but here's a look at the numbers so we can break it down and explain the stipend plans for East Baton Rouge Parish School bus staff. So take a look at this. Board members approved a $7,000 stipend to be paid out as $3,500 each semester. So one payment in October and another one in March. That is in addition to a $2,500 retention. The board previously approved a $3,000 stipend for all support staff when they finalized the budget earlier this month. That equals to $12,500. Superintendent Cito Narcisse explains why they chose doing stipends instead of a pay raise. For um, fairness across all groups, um, even though you, tonight you may approve this is that we should have a plan of doing something year one, year two, and in year three we would have salaries after working out through the budget in that way so the entire staff can uh, feel the same effect. Now this money is for bus drivers, transportation aides, and mechanics. The EBR school board says the plan is to eventually approve pay raises for support staff for the next two school years once they start the next round of budget cuts. But this is a story that is just getting started, and we, of course, will see what happens as they move forward. Matt? Yeah, so much going on with this right now. Dion, thanks for breaking some of this down.